Hello and welcome to this time of children's time at Grace at the Cross. So parents take a moment and gather the children around so they can see this uh, children's time. Children, invite your other friends to come and be a part of this time as well. You can share this video. Can we give all of our friends at home a wave and a hello? Say hello. How's everybody doing today? Yeah, how are you guys doing today? Good. Doing good? Everybody doing good? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, good. Well, remember um, in our other children's times, we got to pick a farm animal to send to help people in need, right? Yeah. Right? We, and we talked about loving our neighbors, right, and how we can do that. Yep. Well, today we're going to pick something different. We're going to pick another uh, thing to be able to send to people in need, right? Okay? But first, we're going to read a story from the Bible, right? Let's read a story. This is a story about... Jesus feeding a whole bunch of people, 5,000 people. That's a lot of people, isn't it? All right, let's read the story and see what happens. It says, It was a beautiful sunny day as Jesus and his disciples crossed the Sea of Galilee in a boat with white sails. Jesus had been healing sick people, and many more people of all ages came to see him again that day. Maybe they could hear more of Jesus' stories or see him show God's power through another miracle. When Jesus saw the large crowd of men, women, and children, he asked his friend Philip, How are we going to get enough food to feed all of these people? Philip answered, I could work for six months and not earn enough money to buy food for all these women, men, and children. All right, let's turn the page. The disciples did not know what to do. Just then, Andrew pointed to a young boy and said, Here is a boy who has five small loaves of bread and two fish. Do you guys like bread? Mm-hmm. Yep. Do you like fish? I, I like cheese bread. Too. You like cheese bread? I, I like cheese bread. Do you like fish? Yeah, I like fish. You like fish too? I like you like fish too? No, I, I, I like cheeseburgers. You like cheeseburgers? Yeah, me too. All right, so here is a boy who has five small loaves of bread and two fish. It is something, but it certainly isn't enough to feed all of these people. The boy looked very nervous as he, as he said in a small voice, Jesus, please take my food if you think it will help. That was nice of the boy, wasn't it? He shared his food. So Jesus took the five loaves of bread and the two fish that the boy offered and asked his friends to have the crowd all sit down. About 5,000 people sat in the grassy meadow by the lake that day. After Jesus gave thanks to God, he blessed the five loaves of bread and the two fish. Then he shared the food with all of the people who were there that day, All 5,000 people ate until their tummies were full. Whoa. Isn't that silly? Isn't that really crazy? That is unbelievable, isn't it? Then Jesus said, now let's gather up all of the leftovers. And do you know what? There were enough leftover pieces of bread to fill 12 large baskets, more loaves and fishes left over than the boy had given to Jesus in the first place. The disciples shook their heads in disbelief as they struggled to pick up the baskets heavy with food. The people saw the full baskets of leftovers and began to understand that something extraordinary had just happened, another miracle. Jesus smiled as he heard people say, God must have sent Jesus to us. It was a day the boy, the disciples, and all of the people will never, ever forget. Wow, isn't that, isn't that amazing? an amazing story? Yeah. There's a question in here. It says, if you were the boy who gave Jesus his food that day, what would you tell people about what happened? What would you tell people about what happened? Uh, I, I, I would not like fish. You would not like fish? I like fish. You do like fish? But what happened? The boy just had 
five pieces of bread and two fish. And then what happened? There were a whole bunch of baskets of bread and fish, enough to feed 5,000 people. Isn't that amazing? All right, so today we want to we want to talk about how maybe we can help feed people too. Okay, guys, so now we get to talk about what we want to buy through the ELCA Good Gifts Ministry to be able to help people in need today. And there are two things that I think you guys are really going to like. Can I share them with you? Oh, yeah. Yep. The first thing, we get to help feed people just like in the Bible story that we just heard. We get to help feed 10 hungry people, 10 people that might go to a soup kitchen that might not have enough to to feed themselves dinner that night. They can go to get food when they're hungry. So we're going to buy something. We're going to buy 10 people, enough to feed 10 people uh, one day. Isn't that cool? You want to help feed 10 people? Yes. Yes? Yes. What's your favorite thing to eat? Chicken. Chicken? You like chicken? What What is your favorite thing to eat? Cheese, cheese bread. What's your favorite thing to eat, Macy? Um, cereal. Cereal? Yeah. Think about, think about you, how many cheese bread, how many cereal, how much chicken you would need to feed 10 people. Isn't that cool? Uh, like, yeah. So we're going to see, we're going to send all of that food to help feed 10 people. Now, the other thing I want to tell you about, the other thing that we're going to buy this time who likes to play? Who likes to use their school supplies? Yay! Pencils, pencils, and crayons, and markers, and paint, and glue sticks, all of that stuff. We're going to buy a whole classroom, a month's supply, a, 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 a supplies for a whole month to be able to use for school supplies. Isn't that cool? Yeah. Isn't that cool, guys? Yeah, so we're going to do those two things with our money this time, and we're going to pray that those that, that food and those school supplies goes to help uh, people that are hungry and boys and girls that are eager to learn in school. So we want to pray for that today, okay? Can we do prayer hands? One, two, three. Repeat after me. Dear God, thank you for food to feed the hungry and school supplies. To help students learn. Bless them and keep them. In your love. In Jesus name we pray. Amen. Thank you guys. You guys did such a good job today. I'm excited. I'm excited about the food. And I'm excited about the school supplies that are going out. Thank you uh, church for your continued support. Uh, of the noisy offering that goes to make uh, these gifts possible. And guess what? I have a secret to tell you guys. I know this is a children's time video, but the grown-ups of the church really like watching this too. So they like seeing you. So let's tell everybody, let's tell everybody, let's wave everybody goodbye and tell them to have a good day. Bye-bye.